We are videotaping Corey, Robert, there's Steve. Hi. And here is uh, your engine, Corey. It's been sitting out here. It's at ambient temperature. Hasn't run. It's all cold. All the gauges show that it's all cold. We're just going to start it. Hooking up the battery here. <clears throat> I'm going to give it one pump on the accelerator. Turn everything on. Magic! <laughs> We've got... What is that? 90 PSI, 100 PSI, cold oil pressure, or, you know, warmish oil pressure. Ambient oil pressure, ambient temperature oil pressure. I'll let it warm up and it'll be another couple three minutes to warm up probably. Yeah. And um, flip it a few times and it's an engine. Yep. Uh, let's see, so far we've run it about, we, we figure about an hour total in uh, three, four different testing sessions. Yeah. Give or take. We did the initial startup. We did uh, an oil change after the initial startup. We've checked the timing. Uh, synchronized and adjusted the carburetors and then we did uh, about 40 minutes of continuous running uh, following the factory break-in procedures. Uh, oh, after we did the initial start and got it up to operating temperature the first time we did a hot cylinder head retort. Um, then the oil filter change and yeah. the oil screen. That's right. Because this has an oil screen, an oil filter inside the oil screen. Right. So that's been done. So we'll just run it a little bit more, run it through another cycle, make sure everything's still leak free and it should be good to put in the car and, and start driving. Yep, should be able to put it in service. Of course, your, your car will sound slightly different. You won't have glass packs on it. But. Yeah, you won't have this quality dual exhaust system. <laughs> hey, no, you, complete, you, with, complete with high performance exhaust leaks. Uh, you, you, you can if you want. <laughs> you could have, uh, I think you should have the exhaust exiting right underneath the front doors. We'll get him, we'll get him some of those lakes cutouts like they used that's, to use on the old hot rods. That's the ticket. With the, with the cable that goes up, you know, into the car. So yeah. you can just have it dump out, you know, the sides and blow flames and stuff. I like that. I think that'd be the ticket. That's pretty cool. It's a beautiful thing. You want to do any more? No. Okay. Thank Sign. you. Thanks. <laughs>